start this. Hi vlog. Hello vloggy vlog. How How's it going? Doing? We are twinning once again and exciting day. I've arrived into Vang. The light is green. Oh shit. Sorry. <laughs> Vlogging. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> don't vlog and drive. Don't just do it. Oh shoot. Shoot, shoot. Don't do what Emma just did. But Sorry. we are in the car right now and we are rushing to the space because we're going to meet my landlords and Austin is going to meet us there. And we're going to get the keys <gasps> to the place. So but this <laughs> I'm gonna have to tape that. I'm gonna have to tape so my ratchet. vlog camera. My vlog. So we were just talking about our vlog cameras being broken 10 seconds ago, yeah. and mine just keeps um, breaking. Yeah. But um, so Emma picked me up from the airport this morning, and she came and got me because um, Austin has all the stuff in his car, so he couldn't come get me, and obviously. Emma was willing and I have able. Jeep, so. Yeah, she's the P of Jeep. So. What else would I be doing? No, truly, nothing. Cleared, what else? Cleared you... my schedule for today <laughs> for 6 a.m. Absolutely. <laughs> but um, but yeah. So we are on our way. We're gonna be a bit late, um, which is not ideal, but not ideal. it's fine. And we're gonna um, pray that we make up some Lost some time. time. Hey MTV, welcome to my crib. Woo! <laughs> I got, no, it was so cheesy. Action. Okay, so this is my new apartment. I'm so excited to show you guys the new place. And it's kind of a mess right now because we've already started loading some stuff, but I really want to show you guys what it looks like empty. And then um, throughout my moving vlogs and apartment vlogs, then you'll see the transition from now and then few months down the road once it's fully furnished but I thought I'd get started with the video really quickly because we have a lot to do today so this is the front entrance that you just saw stunning I'm, queen I'm up behind me being my cameraman <laughs> there she is cameraman of the day cameraman of the day okay so let's get into it I'm like not good at this kind of stuff but okay okay so you walk in front door front door over here we got that okay perfect immediately master bedroom beautiful which okay like we have a few things to discuss like a few things obviously i do love this place but there are some things that would change okay um don't love the carpet but nothing i can do about that but what are we gonna do what are we gonna do um honestly this room feels a lot smaller <laughs> than I originally thought, but it's fine. It is so you win fine. some, you lose some, you give and take. Yeah, so I think the bed's gonna go this way, so where Emma is standing right here, like yeah, I love that. bed vibes, yeah. night table, night table. Window. Mirror, mirror, or mirror yeah. TV. Yeah, whatever. yeah, yeah, love it. Okay, so now let's keep on going. Okay. And this is the walk-in closet, yeah. which um, it's kind of a debate right now. It's up in the air who gets the walk-in closet and I might just be girlfriend of the year and give it to Austin. Wow. Um, that's a big, like, a big I move. I have a lot more stuff than he does, but honestly, like, I might just do it. Um, He's got a keeper. We gotta, we gotta figure some things out first, but this is the closet. Stunning. Um, it's I huge. Like, I like, I, I kind of wish there was a bit more storage. Like, all of these don't need to be full length. Right. You can you put that in, though. You can put that in. Yeah, you can. Definitely. We can add that in. Go to Ikea. No problem with that. Okay, so this is actually my favorite, I think, part of the house. Oh, it's beautiful. The bathroom. Um, I love the lighting. So many, so many TikToks, so many Instagram stories. So many get ready with me's. Absolutely. Are coming your way on at Sophie Sukin. <laughs> um, the shower, it has a seat, which is... Not, Iconic. It's it's not a deal breaker or it's not a, um, a necessity for me, but it is for Austin. His shower at home has a seat, and that's like his favorite thing ever is to like take a shower and <laughs> sit down for like 20 minutes. I love um, that. So, yeah, and then these are just the drawers. There's like lots of compartments, which I really like. There's a so, lot of um, storage in this apartment, tons, which is stunning. Tons of storage, and so we have a double sink right here. His and hers. His and hers. And so Austin and I just figured out that this is the only one that opens. Right. Which is Oh, fine. really? Interesting. Okay. It doesn't really make sense. Not at all. These don't open? 
No, oh, interesting. Tried. Okay. We That's fine though. You still have a cabinet with space though, which yeah, is good. Yeah, at least we have this, yeah. which is fine with me. And I'm sure it'll be all PFG, um, stunning queen. Yeah, um, I'm for sure. That's yours. <laughs> that's I'm your real sure. estate. Yeah. Um, so yeah, so that's the bedroom. Stunning. And you mean the bathroom? Oh yeah, the bathroom. But the master bedroom Oh yes, situation. okay. Um, and then so, front door, you keep walking. We have a coat closet, which... I actually thought the coat closet was over there for some reason. Right. I don't know why, but it's probably like, because you saw this yeah. door. And then we have our washer dryer, um, LG. Love it. I'm pretty sure it's very similar to what I have at home. So yeah. That makes sense. It's big, which is nice too. Um, and then this is the second bathroom, which I'm a huge bath taker. Mm -hmm. So this will be my situation your sanctuary my sanctuary honestly like there's so much room like i don't even know what you're gonna put in there it's gonna be put in here like you know what it's better to have more than less yeah yeah it's just like there's lots of space in like the random spaces right you know I mean? right but it's fine you're gonna need it though sister we're gonna need the more you open your boxes you're gonna realize how much space you actually need the pr okay yeah. so this is the second bedroom which will be a extra closet and I might put a desk. So I'm probably gonna put um, some clothing racks right here. Yeah. And then a desk maybe there, something like that. And- This is actually um, quite spacious. It's quite lovely. Okay, it feels small though. Like, is it the same size as yours? This is about the same size as my office, yes. This really? is like the exact same size. Okay. It might, but like the thing is, your office is supposed to be more small than your room. Right. It's gonna feel better when you have furniture in it. Right. And so if I end up giving Austin the master uh, closet, <laughs> this is mine. Yeah. So it makes no sense. <laughs> no sense. I, I'm sense. putting money on it right now. You're getting the, the, the walk-in closet and Austin's going to be getting this. He literally has no clothes. He literally doesn't. He's not going to fill up the master. I don't know the last time he went shopping. No, it totally. last year. You know what? That you could put like clothing racks, like you said, fill it up with all the clothes. Like, like it'll I'm be fine. I like might have to, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> My scalp is so, or my forehead so itchy from this hat. Absolutely. But um, I'm gonna have to get like some organizational things. For sure. Like, yeah. IKEA, here we come. Okay, so this is the kitchen. The main where event. Magic happens. Yes. Where I'm gonna become um, a food blogger. Yes. I'm Chef of the to, year. Yeah, I'm going to do all my recipes. Hello, fresh. Hello Fresh, we love Hello Fresh, but okay, we'll just quickly give you a rundown. Okay. Did you show them that? No, not yet. Okay. We're gonna we're gonna okay. go into this first. Okay, so this sneak peek. Kitchen. We're doing we're doing piece by piece here. Okay. So fridge, love it. I already have mine and Emma's ginger shots, <laughs> and then my water bottle. Love it. So it's a, actually a good sized fridge. Okay. Um, so just oh, arrived. look who's here. We're Say hi to the vlog, to Austin. Say hi to the vlog. What's going on? <laughs> of course, I'm doing all the work. Yeah, me and Sophie are just filming our house tour. <laughs> okay, this is part of the work. No, totally. This um, is so much work. So this Austin, what are you talking about? The freezer, I assume. Okay. And so this yep, is definitely the freezer. All storage, uh, drawers, all that kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. um, more cupboards. I assume this will be like so much space. One of these will be a, have to be a pantry. For sure, I think a pantry's. This is like, oh, you mean like pantry for food? Like yeah, snacks? Like, like, okay. Like crackers. Right. Okay. Yeah. We're going to have to figure. Yeah. Soups. Definitely going to have to figure out a pantry Chicken. situation. You know what? I think it might be that above. The Open that one. So. Yeah. That could be. Oh, absolutely. That's the pantry, I think. I mean, might have to be a stool. Yeah. <laughs> so, sure. yeah. So then there's the microwave, the um, oven. It's stunning. That I need to use. Yeah. I, I need to start cooking. I haven't used an oven in a long time. <laughs> Or That's ever. Okay. So yeah, we have all the compartments. It's stunning. Um, sink in the middle. Love it. On the island. Also, they left you a PFG rag. Did you notice? Okay, yeah, I didn't know where this came from, but I'm kind of here for it. It's kind of stunning. It is very cute. I'm going to keep that. Yeah, absolutely. And then the very last part of actually, no, we have, we have another thing to show after. Okay. But this is the living space. Stunning. And so... I love the windows. I like the greenery. Like I actually really love that. I do wish it was a city view, mm -hmm. but I like also that it's like trees because it's very like, mm -hmm. it reminds me of Saskatoon. Totally. Do you want me to show the view? Yeah, you can show the view. Okay. <laughs> so cute. 
So yeah, I love the nature vibe of it. Yeah, it's like, really cozy and homey. And if I want the city vibe, I'll just come to your place. Exactly. And We've if, got two backgrounds yeah, now. Yeah. If you want the nature vibe, you can come here. Yeah. But so yeah, I assume the TV will have to go here because mm -hmm. this is where it's meant to yeah. go. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I'm not really sure on the layout. I honestly haven't purchased anything for this space yet. I've mm -hmm. only gotten bedroom stuff. But right. We will get there. With time, it'll come. With time. And I don't know if I should show the balcony. Does that give away where I live? No, I don't think so. Cause since there's like trees, it's not like it's like any okay. buildings. Okay, so this is the balcony. <laughs> All I have to say is green feed goals. <laughs> We, lo we love a good green feed goals green moment. Green, some green I yeah. Got it. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so this is the balcony. Um, it's a, a cute size. I think it's so cute. Not too big, not too small. No, it's the perfect size, honestly. Um, yeah, I just need to get some like a little chair, mm -hmm. a little couch, something. Yes, like a little couch right table. here would be cute. One of those electric fireplaces would be yes. so nice. Oh, yes. Or like a little mini barbecue. Yes. <laughs> I was in barbecues. Yeah. Barbecues at Sophie's and Austin's. Yeah. So, and then you just get back into the kitchen. So Love it. This is the space, the um, unfurnished house tour or apartment tour. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed and let's continue on with the vlog, I guess. I don't know. What yeah, I'm let's, the vlog. I'm let's the move in. We gotta do the <laughs> dirty work now. But yeah, okay. Bye, guys. Okay, so I thought I would do a little quick update for you guys on the apartment situation and how we're doing. The last time I saw you guys, I gave you guys the tour of the place, so I'll let you guys know how far we've gotten so far. So our bed arrived and we got our bed from Sleep Country, so they came and delivered it today, which was super nice. And then um, this is my bathroom right now and it looks crazy. I haven't done anything and I need to like organize this all and like get the right organization. I don't know where Emma went, but I heard her. There she is, there she is, I heard her. Here I am. Um, so yeah, we honestly really, we honestly haven't done really like any unpacking yet. It's more so just been like we went out and got a bunch of stuff from HomeSense and the then essentials. we went to London Drugs and did like a huge haul there of just like necessities like dish soap, laundry detergent, all that kind of stuff. But we forgot scissors which <laughs> to cut everything is, open with you guys. Yeah, so we can't tough. cut we can't cut anything open that we bought. So that's about it. This is what it looks like right now and I think Austin's setting up the Wi-Fi but I think him and I are gonna go to Ikea soon because Emma has to go shoot something big some big tings, big tings coming. <laughs> so she has to go shoot that so um, but um she'll be back tomorrow or I'll, I'll be home. back even if you're not back here I'll be with you at we'll some point so yeah Okay, so I'm gonna set you guys up and I'm gonna show you guys everything we got from London Drugs while um, Emma was with us. She actually just left and went home. But I thought I'd show you guys everything that we purchased because I feel like these are the um, moving out essentials, I would say. We did forget some actually pretty important things like scissors. Um, so we're gonna have to go back out and get some. But I thought I'd show you guys everything we got and yeah, let's do a little haul. So the very first thing um, we got from London Drugs is this Swiffer. And I actually haven't had a Swiffer WestJet in a really long time because my mom has just like a regular mop that she loves and swears by. But I just think for our apartment, like we just want something that's like compact and um, gets the job done. So we got a Swiffer. Okay, this is so much better. I just had to change the setup. But I'm gonna show you guys what we got from London Drugs. So starting off with like cleaning supplies, we have some Windex. And then we also got some pine sole because my mom always uses this lavender clean pine sole and it smells so good. So we just got some of that to like clean um, like the toilets and the bathtub and the floors. So that's what we got there. Um, we got some sunlight dish soap, dish soap because sunlight is honestly 
really good um, for removing stains out of your clothes as well and um, Austin spills mustard on like literally everything he wears so I got some sunlight and it's also great for um, washing your for washing your dishes next thing is another kind of dish soap this is the Myers clean day in the honeysuckle scent I just really love their products so I got this from Myers and then this is the um, multi-surface everyday cleaner the next thing is the JR Watkins hand soap in ocean breeze and I've actually never tried this before but Emma recommended it and she said it's her favorite so um, I bought it <laughs> And then we got some Clorox because COVID is a thing and um, it's really good to make sure that you are using Clorox or Lysol or something that gets rid of um, viruses and bacteria on your stuff. So that's what we got. And honestly, really boring, but I just got some garbage bags. I got small ones and then big ones. So it's just good to always have like lots of garbage bags because it sucks when you run out of them. Then we have some tin foil and some PFG pink rubber gloves, which can't go wrong with. I don't really use rubber gloves, but if I have to, I have them. Um, I got tampons because it's that time of the month for me, which is amazing and really TMI, so I'm sorry. Um, and then this is the razor that I use and I've actually been using this for years and it honestly just like is amazing So it's the Venus um, Sensitive extra smooth and it makes your legs feel so soft. So um, I love that one and then next up is the Garnier micellar water I love using micellar water when I'm washing my face and I didn't bring my bottle of it because it was just too big. So I picked up a new one. And then we have batteries and I think that there's some other stuff. Oh, we got um, laundry detergent and I use Persil. So um, yeah, that's what we use for laundry detergent, but it's already tucked away in the um, laundry room area. Okay, so we actually got toilet paper as well, but toilet paper is very standard. And then this is the last thing that we actually got. And this is the Dr. Teal's Pure Epsom Salt. And I absolutely love Epsom Salt because I love taking baths. Okay, hello and good morning. I am in the middle of doing my makeup, so I thought this would be the perfect time to vlog for you guys. So it is Friday. I don't even know, I can't even think right now, but it is Friday and Austin and I, um, we kind of like slept in a little bit or I wouldn't say slept in because I woke up at eight, but I did lay in bed until 10 because I had some stuff to do on my phone. I had to edit my pictures and he was doing um, an assignment, so. We stayed in bed until 10 and then we went to the grocery store because we have no groceries right now so we just went there to pick up the essentials and um we didn't get too much stuff i mean we our cart was full but you know how that is when like you're moving out and everything is empty so um we just got like staples we got some like orange juice and like condiments like ketchup and ranch soya sauce hot sauce and some fruits and veggies and all that kind of stuff some snacks um so yeah that's pretty much all we've done today and i'm getting ready right now because i'm gonna go meet up with emma she um is actually coming to pick me up um, so we're gonna go to this pop-up because I found the couch that I wanted a few weeks ago and I had reached out to them and I asked if they were interested in collaborating and they very kindly turned me down. Um, so I still love the couch and it's a really great price and um, all that kind of stuff. It was really the only couch that I had seen that I really loved and it just so happened to be a Vancouver based company which is really great because um, 
with like shipping and that kind of stuff and the fact that I can actually go see it in person before I purchase it. So we're gonna go to their pop-up and it's not too far from my place. So that's really nice. And we're gonna go do that. And then I think we're gonna shoot because um, Emma was saying she doesn't have any content right now. And I do have some content to last me over the next few days, but um, I'm down to shoot and um, get some carryover because I don't really know what I'll be shooting next. I really need to buy a tripod, so um, I'll be making an Amazon purchase later today. But yeah, and um, what else? Oh, we went to Ikea last night and I got actually a lot of questions um, asking for an Ikea haul. So I'll do that later, but it's really hard because um, I started putting everything away uh, after we had um, got home from Ikea, I started like finding a home for all the stuff we bought. So it's gonna be like a super random haul, but I'll do that either later today or tomorrow and show you guys everything we picked up. We definitely have to go back because there was quite a few things that I really wanted that they were sold out of. So we're gonna make another Ikea run um, probably in the next few weeks just to go back and see if they have the dresser I want. Um, so yeah, that's about it. And I'm just getting ready. So I'll see you guys when Emma arrives and we're going to the pop-up. Okay, so I thought I would quickly show you guys my outfit of the day. I am wearing this um, Ralph Lauren men's blue and white striped button up and then I have this little cream sweater vest on from Sturettes and I just have like a little skirt on underneath because the um, <laughs> the button up is like pretty short so I just have this little skirt on and then for shoes I have my New Balance so this is my look I think Emma and I are gonna shoot as well. Um, I'm not too sure yet, but I'm prepared just in case. So I'm just waiting for her to come pick me up and I'm gonna do some cleaning um, up before she comes. Okay, hello everyone. Hello. We are back together. Back in action. And, oh, cool. There we go. Um, we're back together and we're gonna go check out the couch that I really like at their pop-up store like I mentioned earlier so we will take you guys in with us hopefully it's the one I think it's, I have a good feeling I really hope I hope it's not in USD like it said <laughs> online <laughs> Good to know. And you can take it along. I mean, obviously. I love the white. Yeah, I like the white. I'm just, yeah, I'm worried because I've been looking at this couch for a really long time. But now I'm worried about the size and I'm hearing about um, the new one that's coming in November. Yeah. Today is Saturday and I just actually went for breakfast with a friend of mine, actually one of my Instagram friends that I met for the very first time but I've been talking to for a little bit. So me and Sienna went to this really cool place called Turf and it's um, it's like a workout studio slash like cafe coffee shop which I think is really cool and it's really um, close to my house. So. Um, I can't wait to continue going there and it's always fun to go to new places but so I have this package right here and I thought I'd open it up on camera because it is my toaster that I'm so excited about. I got a Smeg toaster from the Bay. They were actually having a sale a few weeks ago, so I'd ordered it immediately and I just sent it to Emma's. So when I was at her place last night for dinner, um, I just brought it home with me. 
So I thought I would open it up and do a little unboxing on camera because what else am I gonna do? <laughs> four-piece and it's really big like huge I just don't think I'm gonna need it takes up a lot of space okay so this is the toaster it's really cute but what do you guys think it's pretty it's pretty large I like it a lot though so I think I'm gonna put it right here hey Austin want to come check out the toaster Wait, it's so cute though. I'm actually obsessed. Okay, so I've set up the toaster. What do we think? Do we think it's too big or is this like the perfect size? Like you never know. It is really big though and it kind of takes up a lot of counter space but I could also, also tuck it away if need be but I don't know. 